Well, happy Thursday, everyone. It's going to be sunny and a little bit warmer today. It's going to be nice. Look at this tomorrow, the warmest day of the week. We're going to have a couple warm days this weekend, but 60 degrees, by the way, speaking of the weekend, we've got some rainfall coming early this morning. We were freezing all across the area, and I'll tell you what, we've got some very dry air out there. North winds are dry wind, and look at that. We've got dew points all day in the 20s. Dew points measure moisture in the atmosphere. When we talk about it during the summertime, that that's the air that you wear. That's what you feel when you step outside. But as we go into fall, well, it feels pretty pleasant. But as we're getting closer to winter, when our dew points are 30 or below, that is very dry. And I mention that because the air outside is dry. And if you're using your heat indoors, that's also dry. So that's drying out your skin. So you might need a little extra moisturizer, maybe a little chapstick. We are in that season. So just a heads up. Today is going to be very, very dry. As we go throughout the day today, how about some sunshine? It's going to be nice. We're going to warm into the 50s. Everyone is going to feel pretty good weather wise tomorrow a mix of sun and clouds with highs near 60 degrees for a Friday not a bad way to kick off a weekend especially in December as we go into Saturday here comes some rainfall it's going to begin very spotty or very isolated so you may see a shower or two in the morning you may see a very isolated shower or two in the afternoon but most of the heaviest rain will come very late Saturday this is 10 11 12 o'clock midnight as we go into midnight by the way Saturday here's another recap of the afternoon and evening as we go into the overnight. Here comes some of the heaviest rain and it will be off and on. Here's eight o'clock Sunday morning. We'll still have pockets of heavy rain around. Here's Sunday afternoon pockets of heavy rain around tapers off late afternoon and evening. That's due to a cold front, by the way. So the cooler air spilling in behind that will funnel in some snowfall across parts of the mountains. Higher elevations could get maybe another half inch or so, much less in lower elevations but that'll be late Sunday night as some of that cooler and once again drier air begins to work its way back into the forecast heading into the early part of next week. Let's take a look at these rain totals heading into Saturday night. Some of us will not see anything other than a few sprinkles. Some of us will get some measurable rain, but again, not a ton. Sunday will be the wettest day by far with about an inch of rain expected. Some will get a little less, some will get a little bit more, but because of that Sunday is an impact day. Just a day you might want to be inside maybe snuggle up to the crock pot if you don't have to head out and about. By the way, sundown today kicks off Hanukkah. So there you go. As we go into the weekend, it's going to be pretty nice. Early next week, we will return to sunshine and 40s for daytime highs in the mountains.